Hello, friends, and welcome back to Collecting with Stan. And today, I am going to be opening up one of my packages from economicsandcomics.com. All I've done is took out my address label. Uh, it's a pretty big box. <laughs> it's a big order. So I'm going to crack this open. I'll just set it slightly here off the camera. I'm going to use this beautiful frighter to open it up. I'm a little scared. Uh, last time I used this knife on air, I cut myself with it. So I'm going to be very, very careful because I don't like bleeding on my comic books. Kind of sucks. And it hurts, too, you know. I mean, I don't know if anybody that's just like, you know what? I'm just going to cut my finger because I am bored. <laughs> oh, Got to get the knife. Got to get the tape off it. <clears throat> Tried to get me again. This thing's not nice. Keep fingies out of the way. <laughs> you think I'm joking? That that hurt last time. <laughs> okay, what do we got here? Oh, awesome. Overly packed. Billy even put some uh these blank pieces of cardboard on the top for cutting under. It wouldn't get when damage. I'm gonna use these for spacers in my comic books. And in my uh, boxes. I got a bunch of them and I like that. That's handy. Like I say, Billy always overpacks, which I'm not complaining about. It's nice to get comic books that aren't destroyed. Okay, we got a box in the box. I feel like it's one of those Russian uh, valves that just keeps uh, whoop, that just keeps uh, hatching more dolls as you go into it. <laughs> Nesting dolls, that's what they're called. Yeah. Well, there we go. This is this box. Wonder if there's a box in this box. I gotta get the knife out again. I love knives, but man, my poor fingies. This last time it hurt. It was a good cut. I didn't think it was as deep as it was last time. I uh, put a good a uh, good cut on myself last time. Didn't think I did, but I did. Oh yeah. Okay, good. Looks like we're to comics. <laughs> okay. I don't know what FLC order this was from. He packed these, it looks like. Well, it was ordered on February 16th. So that's not the packing date, but that's when it was ordered. Um, and honestly, again, I don't know what FLC this is because I have another box out there too. Uh, I have, I've been kind of uh, trying to get my knives taken care of and I don't want to get multiple things going. Cool, got some free comic book day books. That's always nice. Absolute power from DC. Spider-Man Ultimate Universe from Marvel. That's pretty cool. Energon Universe 2024 special. That's really cool. Thanks, Billy, for these. Appreciate it. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. That's cool. Like, Billy knew exactly what I liked. That's, see, he does pay attention. Okay, let's get in there. Let's get out some more packaging. What do we got here? Okay. <laughs> okay, this is the Deadpool order. Uh, it's a nine cover pack, so I got nine covers. And as a late release for April 3rd, so that lets you know what when these were, should have been released. But I got two of each. So there you go. This is Deadpool number one. Oh, man, don't hurt the teddy bear, Deadpool. I like teddy bears, man. I don't know about, ooh, that is one hellacious gun there. Deadpool got a really big-ass gun. <laughs> Oh, this is a cool cover. This is why there are so many cool covers on this for this issue one of Deadpool. Check that out. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I got comic books trying to fall off the table over here. I can do enough damage to them without letting them fall off the table. Oh, oh, cool. These are the foils that were in it. Tina will like these. I have its heck to show the cover, but shiny. <laughs> Tina and I are like the same mindset. We both like foil covers. So we always kind of joke about shiny. <laughs> That's a cool looking cover there. Who's that by? Liefeld. Kind of thought it was the way that Deadpool looked. Okay, got a sketch cover here. Might have to see if uh, Squatchy got any of these sketch covers. If he did, have him just send me a, uh, send me a, a, a commission. And if he didn't, I might have to send them on to still get a commission done. Oh, this is too cool, man. These are such cool covers. Just phenomenal. Phenomenal, man. This just... I still love comic books. I, I mean, I enjoy my knives, but... 
I really enjoy comic books. It's pretty cool. I got to get caught up in my reading. I'm hurting today. I've been doing a lot of heavy projects. And I'm hurting. So I think today might be comic book reading day. Check that out. The, the main cover even is really awesome. That's pretty cool. Sit, Ubu. Good comics. No escapee. Okay, what do we have here? Star Wars High Republic Phase 3 Crash Landing One Shot. I got two of these. That's cool. I don't remember if uh, I ordered any of those up from a uh, comic shop that I do locally. So, G.I. Joe, a Real American Hero, 301 third printing. I ordered this because I've been enjoying the book. And this is where they started over with Image in issue 301. And I, I like that cover. I think that cover of Cobra Commander on there just looked really cool. Ooh, 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 these things are trying to escape. Okay, what do we have here? Thundercats. This is a Liefeld original. FOC Liefeld original, it looks like. Two of them for number Thundercats number two. Yep. Pretty cool. This is actually, you know, Liefeld... When he's drawing bodies and stuff, ain't so great, but that's really good art right there. But you know what? Who am I to say when he's drawing bodies and stuff, he ain't that great? The guy became a multi-millionaire drawing comic books. This is issue number one, second printing life held cover. So, you know, maybe I should shut up because I'm not a multi-millionaire <laughs> and I can't draw. It's not fair. Nobody nice to me. No, I'm joking. I'm not going to whine like that. Man, I'm too tough for that. <laughs> okay, got the web of Spider Man. Oh man, good book. Number one variant cover, pretty cool. And this is a, is a five cover pack that he put together. So the five covers, five of the main covers, the main cover there, right there. That's pretty cool. Sit, Ubu. Oh, that is wicked cool. I love that cover. Just look at the. All his uh, nemesis is there. His uh, a bunch of his uh, rogues gallery, rogues gallery. Sorry, cool variant there. And last but not least, another web of Spider-Man number one. Really neat variant cover. Pretty cool. Um, I'll probably be doing another one of these videos. Probably be dropping that. I'm going to say Thursday or Friday. Uh, I think I'm going to start making the 4.30 time slot on my sh channel, uh, be in comic books. Um, so I'm going to start, you know, there will be some lives. There will be some, uh, you know, like this, this videos. I'm um, hoping tomorrow will be Wednesday, the May of 8th, May 8th of May, 2024. I'm hoping to be able to go pick up my uh, comic books tomorrow, get out of the house a little bit pick them up but again it depends on what's happening around here if i'm feeling good i'm going to be working around here um so if i do that do go out tomorrow we'll be doing a new comic book day haul at 4 30 and uh, like i said 4 30 is going to start being my comic book uh videos um i think i'm going to try and put out something at least monday through or sunday through thursday because that's the days my wife works uh take friday and saturday off from the comic books and even my knife stuff kind of slows down a little bit on uh Friday and Saturday, um, but I'm going to try and put something out. Might just be looking at an omnibus, but something that's comic book related, you know, uh, some hauls and stuff. Uh, like I said, I got another box full in the living room to do. That will probably be probably Thursday because, like I said, I'm going to try and take Fridays off. Um, I will uh, hopefully do new comic book day tomorrow, but we'll, we'll see what happens. You know, it's not gonna, it's not a live or die by the sword type of schedule. It's just when it works out. But other than that, thank you all so much for watching. What do you think of my Paul? Did I do good? I think I did. Some great books in there with multiple covers. That makes me happy. A uh, couple that I just got this because I like the artwork on the covers. You know, it was Liefeld Thundercats. I, I, I'm i not a huge Liefeld uh, fanboy, but I thought those were really good. <laughs> you know, so picked them up. <laughs> well, with that being said, I'm almost 10 minutes. Thank you all for watching. If you're already not, please like. If you're already not subscribed, please subscribe. Then like, share, and then comment. Let me know what you think. I love hearing you guys' comments. Thanks for watching. Live long, prosper, and collect your own way. <laughs>